that what it should be called. Yay! First video of Back to Moe's. Yeah, that's really, really embarrassing. I won't say that again. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, today I am so excited for this because I love back to school videos and I love going back to school. I'm a weird teenager, um, but I'm so excited. Ignore the little wire coming out of me. I'm currently filming this when I'm on my IV drip, so it's just ready to be connected up. But I thought, whilst I have some spare time, I would do a back to school haul, what I bought today at B&M, because B&M is life. So anyway, let's get into it. So you'll notice that I have two pencil cases and I'll go through them both in a minute. But we'll first go through these. So I've got my scientific calculator. I've had this for ages, like about three years now. And I absolutely love it. It's nice and thin, so it fits in my side pocket right. Um, because if you don't know already, I have a power chair, so I have a little side pocket to put some of my essentials in so that I can kind of grab it out quickly um, when I'm sitting down in my chair. But this is nice and thin that it can fit in. And my dad soldered <laughs> my name in it so that it didn't go missing as well. So that's great. Then I have <laughs> this notebook. Now you're probably confused on why I got a notebook, but I'm the queen of notebooks. I absolutely love them. And I just couldn't help myself, it's friends themed. But I also need it for taking notes in class. So that's what it will be for. So yeah, just taking little notes, like study notes, if that makes sense. And they'll be all in here. We normally get like a planner in school, which has our timetable in and our diaries and stuff like that. So that's why I haven't got a diary. But let's get into the next part of this. So I will go through this yellow one first. So this is my makeup bag my teaching assistant actually got me this and i absolutely love it thank you mr harvey um but i keep all of like the girly items i need to take to school in here so i will give you a tour of what's in here <laughs> so i first of all have a hairbrush this is so essential just in case a cute boy walks by and you haven't got very nice hair, you can just easily brush your hair and it's just so easy for my hair because mine is lovely and thick but it gets knotty so much that I just need a hairbrush. <laughs> then I have spare hearing aid batteries because why not? I've got some pads for girly stuff. Um, I wear hearing aids, that's why <laughs> I've got hearing aid batteries. And I have some dry shampoo in here, just in case I need it. You never know, it's essential. <laughs> and it smells like coconuts as well. I literally got this when I was recovering from my operation. I can't open it, but I can smell it through the bottle and it smells amazing. <laughs> But I absolutely love it, so yay. Hand sanitizer, so needed right now. This will probably be going in my side pocket, this little thing. But I just thought I'd keep it in here so to show you guys what's going on. I've got two cotton pads because, <laughs> now this is a bit TMI, I get ear infections quite a lot. And more or not, they normally start when I'm in school. So I would just cut these because I have some scissors in there. I'll cut them in half and just put them in my ears to soak up all of that disgustingness. It's just always good to have some as well, just in case you need them. So I just wanted to be prepared. Got a little pot of cream. 
got a nail file just in case I need it because I might need it for those nail emergencies. And it's quite good for just sitting here right now and doing my nails. <laughs> Perfect. They look better already. <laughs> Some perfume. I obviously keep this out on my desk. But I wanted to show you that I will be taking this. Just because perfume is life, guys. And it's rollable as well. And it smells so cute. So highly recommend taking it. Then I have lip balm because, you know, lip balm, <laughs> lip balm is life too. I have a fair hearing aid because I only wear one at the moment. I used to wear two, so that's why I have two. But it's just a spare one, just in case I need to hear what the teacher's saying. If it's too quiet... If it's such a quiet teacher that I can't hear them, I'll put the spare hearing aid in and it'll just be better. And then I know I've only got one, but I wear cleaning wipes. I will be getting more of these because I wear glasses in school. So it's always good to keep this in your bag and it's always good to clean your phone and anything down because it's got some... I think high alcohol in there, so it's quite good. And I use I've used these for years, so and I know they work so well. So I'm very happy that I have some, and I will be putting more in there for later. By the way, now is a girly tip. So if you're a boy or you just don't want to listen to this girly tip. Skip ahead to this time frame. So, girly tip number one. If you are, like, worried about leakage or if you have just a heavy flow, always, always bring to school two nighttime packs. They will do so... <laughs> Alexa, stop. They will do so well for you and I wear nighttime pads all the time even though if even if it's not nighttime because I a I have a tabby flow and B I forget to change my pads every half hour or whatever so they've just done me really well in the past and yay so always keep keep at least two pads especially nighttime ones in your bag because you never know when you might need it <laughs> hello boys welcome back so i've just put all my stuff away and now i'm going to show you what is in my pencil case so this is my actual pencil case this is just my emergency like girly pencil case i guess so yeah <laughs> it's really cute though look at it it's like yellow and then it's got silver accents and i absolutely love it because it has french on it as well and i'm part french so it's amazing but anyway this is my pencil case i think i showed you this in my last back to school haul and it's because obviously we weren't i thought i was going back to school but i actually wasn't at the time so i'm using the same one again because it's just a waste of money to buy the same a different pencil case every year especially if i haven't actually used it properly so yeah this is my back to school pencil case it has central perk um friends the television series and it's light blue which is my favorite color ever and it has white accents like the sofa and stuff but you really have to be sitting close to it to see that on the bottom it says service and then it says how you doing and the new york landscape and i absolutely love new york so it's very good for me <laughs> and then on the little puller thing it has 
Friends the television series again because how much friends can we get? So it is actually really like dirty in here, but whatever. So this is what it looks like. It says GM inside, like the other side of it. But I'm gonna show you what's in it. So this is what I bought today at B and M mostly. So I got a folding ruler because I have wanted one of these for absolute years. So it's like thirty centimeters, I think. And the first one, and then you flip it over, or something like that. It's really cute, and I absolutely love it. So yeah, it's a thirty centimeter ruler, but it can go down to 15 or 14 centimeters so it works small ruler to big ruler <laughs> Woo! and this is actually by oxford so we're getting bougie up in it so i've got my next thing and i know i've got so many highlighters and they're pastel ones because why not your girl really wanted some pastel highlighters to it this year and they're matte I and mean, if anyone knows me what at all i absolutely love matte i cannot have anything shiny especially on my nails which is weird but anyway it just makes me feel better and I can feel them nicely and it calms me down. So I definitely need that. Oh, I've got a yellow one. <laughs> so I've got dark, like brighter pink, then just a pinkier one. Or an orange, I guess you could call that an orange. Got a yellow one, a blue one, a green one, and a purple one because why not and i absolutely love them because they're so cute and i left two out two of them out because otherwise be overcrowded or did i add them back in yeah i didn't leave two out or they're all of them <laughs> anyway so then talking of pens i have a lot of pens in here and here's why in my school you have to have purple and red for marking your own work green for pretending to be the teacher blue and black for writing so it was really important for me to get fine liners that had all of these five colors in and i got them so brilliant with three to spare and this is also going to be working to because like when we go into school, we have our timetables and in form we have like extra time to just kind of fill in our timetables, make them look cute. So that's what the highlighters and the fine liners will be coming in useful because I just want to make everything look cute this year. And I'm also going to be adding my timetable onto my calendar. If you want to know how to work that out, Make sure to watch my next back to school video or the next video you're going to be seeing. <laughs> now, then I got mechanical pencils because with my condition, it's really hard for me to sharpen pencils. So it's really important for me that we got mechanical ones. And I'm really happy because they're just so cute and they're so easy to write with as well. They feel like you work writing with a pen as well so they're really cool also i forgot to mention with the fine liners if you write in colors like all your notes so <laughs> then you're easier to remember it don't know i'm gonna be trying it in a new video a new back to school video but yay so it's cool <laughs> it's really cool so then i got a mini stapler because why not <laughs> and i think they come with red staples in here let me see 
Yeah, little red staples, they're so cute. But you never know when you're gonna need a mini stapler, let's be honest. And it's the right size for me to work with. So, oh gosh, I've broken my stapler. Ah, no I haven't, yay! <laughs> But I just think it's adorable and it's going to work really well in class. I wonder if we're going to be able to use it at any time. And then I've got some scissors because it's hard for me to cut with the normal scissors. And with coronavirus going around still, I don't really want to be handling other people's items. So having my own scissors just makes me feel more comfortable. And then my own glue stick. I will have to replace it because, yeah, there's not much glue, as you can see. So I'm going to change this one out, so I'll just keep it out for a minute, because it's all dried up anyway. But, you, again, I don't want to be handling other people's things. I'm not good at basketball. Um... But I don't want to be handling other people's stuff, really. So, that's why I've got all this. Got all of the colours of the rainbow in these. And then, hopefully... Oh, gosh, I've got a staple stuck to me. Ah! Ah! Right, I'll just leave that there. Gosh. But, yeah, I just thought I'd get everything that I could possibly think that you would need for school because you know like yeah so and i can also get stuff on abstra if i need anything like protractors i forgot to buy a protractor so i need to go and get that but anyway <laughs> that was everything there as i said at the beginning i have a power chair so i don't actually have a backpack so that's why it's a weird what's in my backpack but i think i'll just call it back to school supplies haul because yeah i hope i gave you some tips on what to take to school especially in this yellow bag because this is just amazing i have so many back to school videos coming up right at you soon and i'm so excited for all of them i've got tips and testing tips i've got morning night routines i've got makeup routines literally the whole shebang so make sure to put on your notification to see when those videos come out make sure to subscribe to this channel and like the video <laughs> follow me on instagram because i'll be taking a photo of these and probably posting a photo of my first day of school on there i'll be using instagram a lot <laughs> but anyway i hope you have some ideas of what to take to school and i will see you in my next video bye guys love you you're the best mistake you ever did make You're the best mistake I ever tried to make I thought that I was addicted But now that mistake has ended